Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Raptor and today I'm gonna present you a lot of creatures in ARK, especially now on the center, who just got recently released, that basically everybody hates. It's from creatures that just knock you off from the dinosaurs or just electrocute you without a reason and just in particular are just so stressful that it makes this game so hard to play sometimes, especially for some new guys, it's very, very difficult. And before I start, I just want to remind you that you can put down in the comments what what creatures you hate the most as well and are you enjoying the center so far anyway guys let's head straight into this i'm ready okay for me especially on every map one of the most hated creatures i really can't stand is the micro raptor it's just this little feathery raptors you can't sometimes even define if it's a micro raptor or a archaeopteryx and therefore you don't know if you have to be cautious or not so either way you have to do and oh boy i don't know how much i got into stress i feel like the attack radius from these dinosaurs are just very high and especially because they are so small sometimes you just oversee them and you just see it when it's too late and of course whenever you're kicked off from your creature there's basically every hard dinosaur that's existing on this map just around you just to eat you i know it it's always like that and we will never change shame on you micro raptor next up we have the ichthyornis which is a bird that just eats your food well if you think like that it's not that hard but especially in the early game when you're struggling to find meat or just kill something you just don't have the weapons to do it every time when you have something they just come and eat it. I just hate it. And especially on Ark Ascended, I had the problem on the console that the hitbox of these guys are just sometimes not even existing. So you shoot these things and they just don't realize that you're shooting them. And that's just horrific. And they're always on the beach because you obviously you think that it's the easiest part to spawn in. But with these guys, they just, uh, they just torture you, of course. And even if you don't have food, they just knock your weapon off and that's not even better. So even for me, they are very painful and there are even more of them on Ark Survival Ascended than on Ark Evolved. And I mean, if there is a mod that can eliminate them, I think that's already said everything. Here we have another stealing thief and that's the Pegomastax. Of course, they don't fly, but they are on the ground and I wouldn't say they are fast, but sometimes you just don't see them because they are just coming from a bush and they already steal your stuff because you don't even see it. And he's always stealing my spyglass. I hate it. And if you don't kill them right away, they just run into the forest and you will never see them again. So make sure if you see these guys, just run them right straight behind them and kill them as fast as possible because otherwise you will never get your stuff back. So for me as well very deserved on this list now we come to a one that's um the first time that just give you like a little jump scare or something it's the prolovia these things are always hiding into a small place you just don't see them anyway because if you don't know they exist you will never check a little pile of sands or whatever it is on the ground but when it's too late, it's too late. They'll just jump out of these holes, attack you, and you're already dead before you can do something. It's basically like a Thylacaleo, just that they are jumping from the trees and these guys are coming from the ground. I don't know what's better, I think Polovia is worse. But as well, when you're roaming around the world and they just attack you out of nowhere, it can get you in a very difficult position, that's for sure. I had it already enough, especially in some caves, they're even the worst. And as soon as they attack you, it just feels like you're paralyzed. Well, speaking of paralyzed, I have on the next one on this list, the Electrophorus. So the little eels, um... Yeah, it's one of those creatures that are very painful in the ocean because they are coming in swarms to get you. They are actually quite fast, I think, and you oversee them a lot as well because they are very small. And before it's too late, they always got you. And when you electrocute it, you can just do nothing at all. You just wait for your painful and sad death. So make sure when you're in the ocean that you really, if you see these guys, just avoid them or kill them right away so they won't bother you anyway. And of course, another one in the ocean that are very hard painful are the Knidaria, so the jellyfishes. Oh boy, these guys, they tickle my cheese. I don't know what to say about them because they are slow, yes. You see them, yes. But when they get to you, you're dead, yes. Of course. Because if they get you, you're done. And especially your creature as well. Rest in peace, Sarko. These guys are the reason that I lost my first Sarko and I will never forgive them. Every time I'm in the ocean, I just kill them right away because I don't want to see them. I don't want to have them in a game. They just annoying. 
And yeah, I'm done with these guys. Going over to the swamps, we have some things as well that are very, yeah, jumpy, I would say. I mean, you think it's just a small crocodile with some big legs, but they jump you from far away and they eat you very fast. I think they are not that hard painful as the other creatures, but, but when you're on a small creature in the swamp, they just knock you off the dinosaur and you just don't know what to do. You panic if you don't have a sword to attack it or anything else. What do you do? You just uh, sit there in their mouth just waiting to die. And if your creature are not on neutral to attack them, you're just basically screwed. It's just one of those creatures that I don't like either. But I think if you even approached it once, later in the game, they just don't bother you anymore. But still, you have to be careful with these because you have other creatures like like Baryonyx or Sarkasukus around you that will eat you as well. Or even worse, you get into the water and I just feel like they hear you like from a million miles and smell you right away. You just put a little toe in the water and they already bite you. The freaking piranhas are just a very hard enemy in this game. I don't know what else much to say about them. They just, they just instantly attack you whenever you're in the water and they are just annoying as well because you can't even run across a river without even attacking them. And, and I think for a little fish, they are doing a lot of damage as well if you don't really attack them and they are never alone of course some small things that are quite annoying as well are the titano mimra or how do you call it i don't know those little insects and ants that are always attacking you they always know when they have to come on the wrong moment and they will do it trust me they're easy to kill but they're small you don't see them and they always decrease your stamina when they attack you and it's just painful when you have something that you're running away from and these guys come to you attack you you have no stamina you have the giga behind you what do you do uh, well you die of course that's why they are there for and for the last one on this list i have something that's a little bit annoying but even later in the game they are not that hard but the raptors in these games even in the beginning of a the game they are stressful and they just ruin your whole game all the time because they are fast small strong and the only thing that can uh, prevent you from saving them against them is if you have maybe a bola to attack them so they can immobilize and you just can attack him or run away whatever you want to do but other than that they are just very hard in this game especially really in the beginning they will kill you not even once that's for sure and they are always there where you want to go of course they just know and on arc ascended i feel like they became much smarter than before but that's just my opinion okay okay that should be it if you have any other creatures that are bothering you on the center leave it down in the comments because maybe i missed someone i don't know but these are especially in my opinion one of the worst ones because they just uh, give you a hard time every time and i don't want to counter them of course and you don't want either so make sure you avoid them and if you're down there maybe a like would be appreciated thanks very much anyway guys thanks for watching and i'll see you hopefully in the next video wrap it out